Hi everyone, welcome to another edition of ID Maker Tutorials. In this video, we're going to be walking through designing an ID card template and how that can be used with a profile database to automate the batch print process. First and foremost, you need to know what fields you want to include on your card. Fields uh, can always be added and subtracted later, but a good way to start is by looking at what your database includes. I've got a very basic database for this example, so choosing the fields is going to be pretty straightforward. I'm going to want to select first name, last name, grade, and then their headshot for picture. Now when you log on to ID Maker 3.0 and start a new project, you can specify exactly what fields you want to include. Go ahead and double click the fields that um, are pertinent to you. For my case, I'm going to choose a double click first name, last name, go down and grab grade. And picture one. Now you can choose to import your database file now, or like me, you can create a new database, which really means you're going to choose to import your database later. Now with these fields, you're not going to want to type in what these you know, first name, last name, grades are because the database is going to populate that information. So we're going to use this as a template and these fields will be populated with the database. So once your template is created and you can design it as you want, you're pretty much ready for importing the database. Feel free to follow along as I design my card. But as soon as you're ready with your card design, you're ready to import your database. All right, my card design and template are ready. So we're going to go ahead and import the database next. If you're interested in learning more about ID Maker, continue watching this series. Subscribe for new content or call for a live demo. Thanks for watching, and until next time, design on.